Introducing Cheyenne's new 74-inch compact tractor snowblower, providing even more height at 27 inches high. With the industry's first concentric access design and other standard features, the 600CT puts the snow where you want it. For more information on the Cheyenne Compact Tractor Snowblower, visit CheyenneMFG.com. Going back in history, we've always rented equipment to farmers, other customers, agriculture related. And uh, then we found that some of the products that we offered for them cross over to homeowners, smaller contractors, and that the first thing that comes to mind would be the skid steer loader. So we started out renting skid steer loaders and then uh, mini excavators. Uh, and then, you know, as people came in and said, well, do you have a sod cutter? You know, a landscaper might come get a skid loader from us. Do you have sod cutters? Uh, as things, people made suggestions, and, and companies were very helpful who rep these products to tell us, you know, what the popular things were and things like that. So we kind of went on their recommendations and the requests of our customers, and we built up a rental fleet, and we actually separated as a separate business. and. Uh, and then it's it's kept growing, and we we've gotten into extend the boom forklifts, uh, uh, the man lifts, uh, towable man lifts. Many one of our most popular items now is a towable man lift. That if somebody's got a half ton truck, they can come in and rent a a forty some foot boom lift, and with some instruction, it's very easy to operate. Do a lot of their own tree trimming, house painting, things like that. So much safer than the ladder. And, right and. Uh, that's uh, very popular among uh, our LPOs or our lifestyle people, homeowners, small contractors. So uh, that started like that and has, has kept on growing. So and is actually has a presence at every one of our locations. Every one of our locations has a rental fleet. I think they, each manager does a really good job of listening to the consumer's needs. And they'll keep a log of either requests or of lost rentals that we've had because we haven't had that piece of equipment. We review that usually quarterly and we'll look at, okay, here's some potential with this product. We could have rented it X amount of times. Let's get some pricing from our vendor. Let's see about adding this to our fleet. Adversely, too, we, we take a look at, okay, these products have not been bringing in any income at all. Turn around, get them marketed, move them out. Mm -hmm. So we review that. Deer has quite a bit of it. Mm -hmm. uh, deer, uh, you know, of course, has the major equipment like the skid loaders and things like that. But also some of the handheld walk-behind equipment, they've marketed through Order Zone. They get it from Brindley Hardy or mm -hmm. whatever, and then they market it through John Deere Order Zone, which makes it convenient for us. Uh, Pricing is always competitive, but for some of the other products, we go through. Uh, local distributors, other local uh, uh, dealers, and uh, we work with Wacker a lot of our concrete equipment. Wacker, uh, Wacker products, Wacker, Wacker Nissan, uh, uh, Menominee uh, Falls. Uh, uh, we get a lot of uh, uh, our concrete equipment, our uh, cutoff saws, compactors. Uh, almost exclusively, we get all that small contractor type stuff from them. And then uh, Bill Jacks is uh, a company we get our uh, towable man lifts from. So, and then some of the equipment we buy pre-owned or from out of other people's rental fleets. Mm -hmm. 